Uh, if I look tired, I it's because I am tired. It is now 8.45, Super Tuesday, and I just left my job at the polling precinct in Newell, California. I arrived at 6.30 this morning, so I, that's, that's quite a day. I mean, I feel like Liz Warren, and, and I'm ready to concede. Um, so working, working at a voting place was it, it was nearly everything I dreamed of, except that I wore the wrong shoes and my feet freaking hurt so badly. Why did I wear the shoes that, that aren't comfortable? Nobody could even see my feet. They were behind the counter. Um, but beyond that, so as, as I've mentioned, I live in a, in a very conservative um, Trump, Trump supporting area with these are the people who they just they call this the state of Jefferson because that's their imaginary land um, and I had I had to clench my jaw a lot today as people said disparaging things about things that are important to me um, but I wasn't in my I wasn't in my place and I needed to remain as neutral as possible however I did have a really good conversation with one one um, conservative, very conservative rancher woman who actually sat down with me and we had had like just a really civil discourse about, you know, how we felt about a few different things and how she has a friend that is a, lives in Belgium and so she's discussed socialized medicine and things with her. And it was so refreshing to not just have, just not have you know, someone just dismiss me up here as if I am just so foolish. So anyway, you know, good people, hardworking, really great people. Um, ideologically, we're probably closer to the same than, than we are different. And it was a really good experience. Tiring. But apparently, I'm going to get paid something like a hundred bucks. I, th I thought I was just volunteering. And then they told me, no, you'll get a check in the mail. I'm like, what? So, with my large windfall, I'm going to buy some new shoes. Good night.